The state looks at setting up medical marijuana dispensaries. Members of the public get to give their recommendations. That public hearing just began at the state capitol. And that's where Paul Drews is live with more on the dispensary task force meeting. Paul. Earlier this month, the task force released a report detailing suggestions for dispensaries set up around the state. Now, the public will get their say. This is the second of two public hearings on these dispensaries. And whatever those suggestions are, many of the medical marijuana users say it is high time Hawaii had a legal way for them to get their prescription pot. Now, Hawaii was one of the first states to establish a medical marijuana program by legislation back in 2000. But Hawaii doesn't have what many other states have, medical marijuana dispensaries. According to the task force report, based on the number of registered patients, roughly 13,000 statewide, a minimum of 15 to 30 dispensaries would be needed, at least one for every 500 to 1,000 patients. How those dispensaries would be run, including the application and registration fees and even the number of plants that would be allowed, is still up in the air. But a number of people that I talk with at tonight's meeting are concerned as much about the nuts and bolts of how those dispensaries would be operated. Instead, they're more concerned that there's access for medical marijuana for those that can't grow their own. Reporting live from the state capitol, Paul Drews, KITV4 News.